Hi, I'm Daisy Wright with your latest serving of GW Slice. Despite not being in competitive action, Tiger Woods is still dominating the golfing headlines. His arrest and subsequent fallout has been the talk of the golfing world. Everyone has had their say, but we feel the last word should go to Martin Keimer, who felt obliged to upload his thoughts on the matter. Hey guys, I have something to say that, uh, that bothers me already the last couple of days, to be honest. Why are you being so nasty? I mean, why don't you try to do the opposite and help him now? The way he inspired us. Um, that's why we are where we are now. My wish would be just stop being so nasty, try to help, and um, yeah, we all want to see him be happier and hopefully one day to see him play golf again. That's my only wish. So be kind and all the best for me. Tiger Woods superfan and PGA player Zach Blair was in action at Muirfield Village over the weekend. Despite having won just shy of $3 million, plus having his own equipment deals, he took to eBay to buy a pair of golf shoes. Never one to miss a bargain, he also popped into the PGA Tour's new official restaurant, Arby's, who were offering a free meal to any golfer teeing it up over the weekend. At least Tiger won't have to deal with the rough at Erin Hills. Wes Bryan found time for a practice round at this year's US Open venue. We're in the fairway here, but if we go one, two paces off, stuff's about two feet tall. That's all for GW Slice, but don't forget you can download the podcast, check us out on the usual social media channels, or find our old golf gear on eBay. Bye.